Mga Asagpi, welcome back! At ngayon, we're diving into the world of turn-based RPGs as we review 5 exciting Steam game demos na sinamuha ko recently. Meron tayong Portal Fantasy, Quartet, Alterium Shift, Peacemaker Glorious Princess, saka Terra Memoria. Bawat isa sa mga games na ito ay may unique na gameplay experiences at nandito ako para ibahagi ang thoughts ko on each one. So if you're looking for a new RPG adventure na pwede mahooked on, tutok lang. Let's go! Unahin na natin ang Terra Memoria. Sandali ko lang nalaro to kasi bigla nila tinanggal yung demo. Yung combat system niya hindi complex tapos full heal after each combat kaya medyo boring. Again, around isang oras ko lang nalaro yung demo so please consider it. Yung quest saka puzzles niya simple lang pero I enjoy it. Wala akong video pero meron din crafting system and it looks so satisfying. Yung visuals and art niya ay very cozy. Okay din yung sound effect nito. Napaka unique. O nga pala if you enjoyed this review and want to see more awesome gaming content, huwag kakalimutan to hit that like button, share it with your friends na mahilig sa RPG, and subscribe to my channel. Ito yung ratings ko. Maganda yung game worth it. Kung mahilig ka sa hayop at turn-based RPG, bilhin mo na to. Next natin ay ang Peacemaker of Glorious Princess. Minus points agad dahil medyo mouthful ang title ng game. <laughs> yung plot naman na ito medyo basic. Yung main protagonist, princess na gusto ng revenge. Tapos kasama niya yung simp bodyguard niya. Unique yung combat system niya, nababawasan yung tao pag nababawasan ka ng HP. You can change the difficulty sa loob ng game, pero alam kung yung pinili mo sa umpisa ay extreme difficulty. Maikli lang yung demo. Okay naman kaso medyo pricey siya. Ito yung ratings ko.
Ginugol ko yung quartet definition. Ang sabi, a group of four people playing music or singing together. Gusto ko yung combat system niya. You have to swap or juggle party members inside or outside the battle para smooth yung paggrind mo. Okay din yung plot niya. We'll keep you wondering what's next. So they have a talking hippo that can give you milk for a ton of heal. I mean, come on. If that's not a good character, ewan ko na lang. Tapos meron din fat guy who can heal everyone by giving them a cake. Maganda yung game kaso TBA yung price. If it's around $20, I'll buy it. Ito yung ratings ko. By the way, I also post gameplay videos every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday. So check those out too. Salamat! Thank you, Tank Twister. I'll tell you shift yung next na game. Another classic looking RPG. Yung plot niya simple lang, pero a bit too early to tell sa demo. Combat system is not complex, pero it's fun and nostalgic. I love the game's humor, lalo na yung dark humor niya, and they have plenty of them. So this is my ratings. In visuals and sound niya, I adore it. Very nostalgic vibe. Tapos last but not the least, Portal Fantasy. Medyo weird tong entry kasi lahat ng nasa list ay single player. And this one is an online game.
it has a cool starting plot. Parang Pokemon, pipili ka ng starting monster which they call Porbos. Yung combat system unique din. Yung mga backup mo na Porbos give passive ability to help yung lumalaban na main purpose mo. Okay din yung mga puzzles niya. Similar talaga sa Pokemon game. Overall, excited din ako balikan tong game. Pag nagka-time ako, laruin ko to. And this is my ratings. Salamat sa panonood mga kasakpi. Sana nagustuhan nyo ang limang must play turn based RPG na may classic charm dito sa Steam. Kung may mga games na namiss ako sa tingin nyo dapat ko isama, i-comment nyo lang sa baba at gagawan ko ng video yan. Huwag kalimutan mag-like, mag-subscribe at i-hit ang notification bell para updated kayo sa mga susunod na videos ko. Happy gaming at hanggang sa muli. Yeah.